I think Moroccan women will find a few things attractive about Mark. He's tall, he's successful, he's starting to realize that he's getting older, he wants to settle down, he wants to have children and have a family. But I was born and raised in New Jersey, so I know a lot of American men like Mark. From what he initially told me about himself, he is a frat boy in a 44-year-old's body. If Mark truly wants to find love in Morocco, he needs to get comfortable going past surface level and getting vulnerable and being deeper. And I know that I can definitely help Mark to get there. Never seen a hotel like this before. Hello. Hello. Hi. How are you? I, just call me Mark. OK, Mark. Tomorrow I get a chance to meet Nina for the first time, and I'm excited to see what she's got in store for me. So I'm just going to ask you to fill this for me, please. So do you have any information about the Moroccan culture? Only from what I've learned today. So the first thing you should know that it's a conservative country. It's totally forbidden to have a female friend with you in a room in a hotel if you're not married. This is the law. No, come on. It's yes, the yeah. Law. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Like a totally illegal, like you go to jail. Yes, exactly. And another thing, so no intimacy in public, kissing in public. What about holding hands? It's, it's not really appropriate in Morocco. New rules already. Look, <laughs> just... You can't hug, you can't kiss, then you definitely are not bringing girls back to your place. Is every single date coming to an end with a handshake? Hey, have a good night. Have a good night. And this is your bed? Your bed? <sighs> I'm definitely worried about connecting with someone, and then there's just nothing physically to see if it's there or not, because everyone I've ever gone out with, it's always been there physically. And if we don't have that aspect, it's kind of be hard to judge how well we get along together. Thank you for your help. See you later. OK, Bye -bye. good night. Good night. I knew Morocco and the Arab world was a little more conservative, but I was not ready at all for what I'm hearing. Hopefully with my matchmaker, Nina will help me find the path to success with all of these conservative rules that I'm not used to, and I can find my perfect mate. First bed. Ah. <sighs>